What I want to talk to you about today, for those of you who don't know me, I'm actually a microbiologist, a skin scientist. What's a skin scientist? Well, my um, expertise is actually the following. My expertise is what happens on a molecular level and a cellular level when everything is going well in the skin. What happens when it's not going so well? And how do we take active ingredients and formulate a product in terms of pH, concentration, form of active ingredient to bring it back to a healthier state, healthier skin? So that's my expertise. In 2007, I started a skin care clinic, but it's a different one. We call it a medical spa, but really what it is, is it is a scientific skin care clinic. So I wanted to create a, a place that women and men could turn to for unbiased scientific skincare recommendations. Because in my world, there's a couple of things that are happening. First of all, people are confused. Are they confused? Yes. About the products that they should use. Can I use them together, Marie? What's my skin type? You know, people want to work on brown spots and they think they have the right product and they totally don't. Um, so, so that's my expertise, is really to design the perfect skincare uh, regime that is customized and personalized based on your DNA or your DNA. So it's actually, it's really, really powerful. Not only do I do that, still to this day on a daily basis, I see people for uh, skincare consultations, but also I wanted to have a place where there would be accountability because there are very few places where that actually track results over time. So, and that's another, you know, another place where the skincare world fails is there's no tracking. We don't know if those high-end brands actually work. So how do you know if it works if you don't track? So this is something that I do. I track with a computer-based analysis that's called Visia. So you track at baseline, so the when they come in, and then three months, and then six months, and then a year, and then you see the improvement that the skin um, uh, experiences. Now, I used to have a challenge with natural products. I'm going to like be bold and transparent and authentic. When I started my clinic, people would come to me, you know, the natural, it was starting slowly, and people would come to me and they would say, oh, Marie, I want something that's natural. And I would be like, oh, tch, tch. <laughs> natural. Poison. You know what I used to tell them to like, I used to tell them, well, you know, poison IV is very natural. You'd, you don't want to have it on your skin. And they'd be like, oh, oh, okay, oh. But people kept on asking and asking and asking. So one day I needed to go and find a natural skincare product that actually worked, and I couldn't find any. It would take so long for us to get results from a natural product that people, like, we don't have the luxury of time. We want results. We want instant results. And I couldn't find a natural skincare product that would actually yield results and improve the different aspects of, of skin health. What I want to teach you today, and I want to walk you through this, is how to judge a skincare line. As you know, the Optimera product and the Nerium 80 product for our, our US folks, but Let's focus on Optimera. This product is natural, and it yields results. And what I want to teach you today is that you're going to encounter a lot of products in the field that are natural, but they do not come close to what Optimera does. And I'm going to show you how to analyze a skincare, a natural skincare line, okay? I want to talk about the main causes of aging because aging is the, the thing that is the number one thing that is requested by my patients. They come to me and they say, well, there are two main, main things that people come to me for acne, but aging, aging is huge and it's growing and more and more people in their 20s and 30s and 40s. So it's not only people in their, their 50s and 60s that are actually requested, requesting to work on, on anti-aging. It's the younger generation as well, more and more. So this is a huge trend. I want to talk about the main causes of aging and then put Optimera in perspective. So one of the first symptoms of aging that we see is actually starting to lack firmness and elasticity. And the cause of that is collagen breakdown. So breakdown of collagens, breakdown of elastin, breakdown of hyaluronic acid and um, uh, glycans as well that will actually thin the skin, and what you see as symptoms is lack of firmness and elasticity, okay? Which is different than the second symptom of aging that is also due to 
I mean, uh, you know, degradation of, of the deeper layer of the skin that translates into having wrinkles. So you've got firmness, you've got elasticity, the snap back to the skin, and you've got the wrinkles. The third aspect of aging actually relates to discoloration and skin changes in terms of unevenness of the skin and pigmentation. Freckles, you know, people tell me, oh, Marie, freckles are so cute. Well, you know, from a scientific aspect, freckles are not cute to me. <laughs> and I, yeah, it's like, what? Because freckles, to me, when I see that, it means that there's been some sun damage. Everybody has a different threshold for, for, for freckles, really, okay? Um, uh, but freckles, to me, as well as age spots, liver spots, brown spots, call them whatever you want. They are discoloration, they are sun-induced mainly, and it's a sign of aging. Remember, everybody ages differently. Some people are gonna get one out of the five, other people are gonna get all five, okay? So everybody ages differently. Another cause of aging is actually the production of free radicals. So you might have heard of antioxidants before, okay? So, but free radicals, let me take you back. So free radicals are actually toxic and very reactive molecules that actually attack our skin cells. Free radicals are everywhere. They attack all of our cells, and our cells are constantly fighting, constantly fighting to, repay, to neutralize, if you want, those antioxidants, okay? So that the damage is uh, less important. Um, and then there's also inflammation. So this is a huge up and coming, um, uh, it, it's fairly recent that we discovered the involvement of inflammation in aging. We actually call this phenomenon inflammaging, okay? So it's, it's aging of the skin, of the whole body really, but it's aging of the skin caused by inflammation. Where does that inflammation come from? It comes from many different sources. You can have naturally high level of inflammation in your body because of your genetics, uh, but also the diet is huge. So everything that's good basically, okay? Sugars and bad fats and um, uh, dairy actually elevates the uh, inflammation levels as well and inside of the skin. Introducing Optimera. So the strength of Optimera is that it is actually a multitasking skincare in order to have healthy skin. And the main um, strength of it, well, one of the strengths, but the number one, I think one, what makes the difference between Optimera and the other natural products is that of course it's natural, but it works on all five aspects of aging. Okay, that's very important. It's a very complete product. It's a very complete product. We don't have time anymore to have an eight-step approach, okay? The cleanser, the toner, the eye cream, the serum number one, the treatment number two, the prescription product, the moisturizer, and the sunscreen on top, and the BB cream, okay? It takes like 15 minutes in order to do so. So the trend right now in skincare is really to uh, have one product or two products, a very streamlined routine that will work on all aspects of aging. So this is our strength. There's a lot of products out there that are natural, but they only work on one or two of the, of the causes of aging. Ours works on all five aspects of aging. So remember that one, it's very powerful. Any people really interested in ingredients here? Mm -hmm. I'm an ingredient nerd too, okay? I'm gonna go quickly through this one, but what I want you to remember, we have a patented extract. So we have a technology, an active ingredient in Optimera that is ours and will never be someone else's. It's ours and we're the only ones to have it and it'll always be that way, okay? Yes, this is very important. This is very important because what's happening right now in the market, and remember, I have a medical spa, I have eight different skincare lines that I carry, I have two different makeup lines, I know how products are formulated and what they contain. And what we're seeing really is a lot of the um, uh, product lines out there, they kind of all have the same active ingredients. You know, they have glycolic, they have retinol, they have vitamin C, they have salicylic acid. So there's nothing, there's no one product that actually rises to the top. 
and that's really exclusive in terms of active ingredient, but this is something that we have with Optimera. Biden Spilosa, which is the, one of the active ingredients in, in the Sal 14 extract, and Centella Asiatica as well. So Biden Spilosa and Centella Asiatica are two anti-aging um, uh, active ingredients, but they work really, really differently. Um, the uh, Biden Spilosa has retinoid-like properties, so it behaves like a vitamin A, and what we know is that vitamin A is very good for the skin. And the Centella Asiatica is more repairing, soothing, you know, and it, it, it repairs the skin. Um, we have a plant cell duplication technology, which is really interesting. Remember, please remember the following if anybody asks you. The plant cell duplication technology is actually a sustainable way of getting our active ingredient. So, you know, up to now, what a lot of companies do, you know, they take the, the plant, they crush it, right? And then they extract the active ingredient. The plant cell duplication technology, which is where the Centella Asiatica comes from, is very different and it's sustainable and it's a pure Centella Asiatica because what they do is that they take the cells from the plant, they put it in a Petri dish, and then they grow those cells. And then they extract the active ingredient from it. So you don't need to worry about pesticides, you don't need to worry about Mother Nature, you don't need to worry about pollutants, toxins, anything like that. It makes for a very pure and a very sustainable way of harvesting our active ingredient. That's really important. Yeah, it's, it's outstanding, you guys. <laughs> Aloe vera, soothing, calming, nourishing, lots of minerals in there, strengthening the skin. Green tea, which is an anti-inflammatory. We also have some peptides. I love peptides. Oi. Peptides. I dream about peptides at night, okay? <laughs> like, seriously. Oh, my little peptide. How are you? Um, peptides do lots of different things. Peptides are small chains of amino acids in a row, and uh, they can be anti-aging, they can be anti-inflammatory. We have vitamins as well, a cocktail of vitamins, and one of my favorite um, active ingredient as well, CoQ10. So coenzyme Q10, I call it my cell energizer, okay? Coenzyme Q10, it just makes all of your skin cells uh, have more energy, so they have more energy to produce the fibers and to, 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 do, to do their job, basically. Um, synergy of formulation. Clinical trials uh, have been done on Optimera, of course, and we have before and after pictures. I want to draw your attention to this picture, actually, which shows a reduction of wrinkles by 41% in 28 days. I have never seen this before in my life. I have never seen a product that works so fast, so healthy, and that works on all signs of aging. We're going to see more pictures, more before and afters, actually, in a few minutes. Another thing that is beautiful about Optimera is that it's a multitasking product, but it's also um, ideal for all skin types. So whether you have dry skin, normal skin, combination like me, or oily skin, uh, you can use it, the AM and the PM. Non-comedogenic, what does that mean? It's not going to promote acne. It's not going to promote blackheads and bumps. No sulfates, no parabens, no gluten, no mineral oil, no DEA, no silicones, no added fragrance. Whatever you smell from the product is not a fragrance. It's actually um, the smell of the blend of the active ingredient and the formulation, so that's really important. Okay, we've got a great product, but it takes more than a great product to make you know, to make a great um, product line or a great offer. You need to do what I call my background check. So my background check goes as follows. If I have a great product, I ask myself on top, you know, I analyze the ingredient and everything, and then I ask more questions. The first thing, does it have real science? I've said it before in St. Louis when we were at convention, but Mar you can do a lot of stuff with marketing, okay? You can manipulate the image of a product. You know, you, you take a product like this, you put a Petri dish, you put like a little beaker with a little blue solution in it, and it's like, science-based, okay? <sighs> Don't be fooled, okay? Real science. I have worked for the largest cosmetic company in the world, which we all know who, who they are, Gloria. <coughs> um, <laughs> I have never seen, okay, I've seen the clinical trials from L'Oreal, okay, because I was there. 
I have seen the clinical trials for Optimera. I have never seen any clinical trials and any basic research so advanced as I have seen with the Optimera. It has never happened to me. You really see uh, the difference, you know, between a product that comes from the cosmetic industry and a product that comes from the biotech industry. It was a huge breakthrough for me to understand that, wow, this is it. This is like Nerium International, and this stems from a biotech company, the, the technologies, and it's different from anything that's out there in the market. Exclusive active ingredients, we've got our Sal 14, we've got our Centella Asiatica, the whole blend, the synergy of formulation as well, the clinical studies, which we're gonna see in a few minutes, and then also the patient's feedback. I always say you could have the best, best product, best active ingredient in the world, if you put it, if you formulate it in, in a Vaseline base, it's not gonna sell. You're not gonna be successful. People are not going to buy again. And this is the strength of Optimera, the strength of Nerium AD. People are so satisfied, they want some more, 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 right? And people love the texture as well, which is huge in, in our industry. Clinical studies, I want to uh, show you some before and afters. I know you've seen uh, some of those before, but I want to walk you through them. So on the left is the before, the after on the right. I want to draw your attention to the upper lid. Look at the upper lid on the left versus the right. After 28 days, it's more tucked in. Imagine what we would get after six months, okay? Imagine what we would get after a year. Crow's feet, same thing. Look at the improvement in 28 days. It's phenomenal. And then under here, the under eye bags or the, the dark circles in the bags are something that is requested by women all the time. Oh, Marie, I look so tired. Everybody thinks I'm tired, but I'm not. You know, what can you do for this? You know, people don't all want to go under the knife, right? So this is after 28 days. Look at how much more healthier the um, eye contour looks. The second uh, picture, I want to draw your attention to the pigmentation. So I was telling you that it actually helps improve the appearance of uh, uneven skin. Well, you clearly see it there after 28 days once again. So look at the freckles, look at the age spots. A uh, huge improvement in the appearance of age spots, actually. This is another very, very good um, um, picture for wrinkles on the forehead, under the eye area here. Look at the bags as well really, really tucked in. I mean, you know, this woman, when you look at her on the left, it's taken 65 years for her to get there. Give her 28 days and look at what it does, right? It's pretty powerful. This one, I want to draw your attention to the redness, actually. Redness and inflammation, as you know, Optimera has a soothing and a calming properties um, as well. And this one is kind of a it's kind of a melting pot, yeah? So you see kind of everything in there. So this is why I chose that, that picture because I thought it was really representative. So you've got the redness before and after. You've got the wrinkles. Look at this on, on the neck here. You've got the pigmentation that's better as well and just the overall texture. So it's really a multitasking product that gives us outstanding results. So you've got a product that works on all five causes of aging you've got your background check, okay? And I invite you to do this every time you see a new product, every time somebody challenges you, oh yes, but Marie, mm, what about this product? Go, does it work on all aspects of aging? Do, have you done your background check? Do you have real studies? Do you have active ingredients uh, that are exclusive? Guys, what I wanna say to end is, I have been so grateful and so impressed with Nerium and what's going on at the back and the real, the true core of the people who are in, you know, who are managing this company is absolutely outstanding. And I feel so blessed to be able to be a part of this family. And I welcome you to the Nerium family. Let's have a blast. Let's be successful. Thank you very much.